Om Shanti. Today is 15th July 2023 and we shall listen to the essence of today's murli. In the essence, Baba says, sweet children, give the father news of your stage with an open heart. Remembrance of the father can only stay in a true and open heart. The question from today's Murli is, although all young and old are at this time in their stage of retirement, what words can you not say? Answer, Baba, now hurry up. Let's go home. There is a lot of sorrow here. Baba says, you children cannot say this because you are now sitting personally in front of God. You have now received the lap of coolness. At this time, you have become the highest on high. In the golden age, your degrees will be reduced. You will become deity children, not God's children. This is why you cannot say, hurry up. Hmm? Baba normally used to say in other murlis also that when we say Baba hurry up means we do not have love for the father. So never say this word. The essence for dharma from today's murli is in order to claim a scholarship, study very well. Raise to be seated on a throne. Stay in remembrance while doing everything. Second point. You are on a spiritual pilgrimage. Therefore, remove the remembrance of everyone else from your intellect and constantly stay in remembrance of the Father. Keep your register of remembrance good. Bhakta Dada's blessing for us children today is, may you be an embodiment of power and become worthy of worship by bidding farewell to all the vices and becoming a constant yogi and constantly pure. I repeat, may you be an embodiment of power and become worthy of worship by bidding farewell to all the vices and becoming a constant yogi and constantly pure. All of you children receive two main blessings from the father. May you be a constantly yogi. May you be pure. Those who experience these blessings in their lives constantly are not yogis for two or four hours, but they are constant yogis. They are not pure just sometimes, but are constantly pure and have bid farewell to all the vices. It wouldn't be that they sometimes become angry or have attachment. Any vice will not allow you to become an embodiment of remembrance. Only such yogis who are embodiments of power and those who remain constantly pure become worthy of worship. Today's slogan is, stay constantly in front of the sun of knowledge and your shadow of fortune will always be with you. I repeat, stay constantly in front of the sun of knowledge and your shadow of fortune will always be with you. Acha Om Shanti.